Hey you all, it's your girl, the internet host. And for today's vlog mga curls, I'm gonna be showing you a perfect skincare routine pagdating sa acne prone skin and oily skin and also a perfect makeup routine pagdating sa acne prone skin and oily skin. This is super perfect if you have pimples or breakouts and if you want to cover it at the same time and treat your pimples at the same time, this vlog is definitely for you. And also if you're like me mga curls, I'm very oily skin and acne prone skin. Actually mga curls, hindi nga lang oily. I'm like literally the sweatiest person ever. Like konti kibo, pinapawisa na ako. Like I just can't can't with the heat. Pero alam niyo ba, Chris, like, comment down below. Pansin niyo din ba? Hindi masyado ba init ngayon sa Pinas, ah? Like, what's up with the weather? Like, I heard it's snowing in Tagaytay. Like, is it just me? Or the weather is getting weird? But I'm not complaining, okay? So, yun nga, mga Chris, I'm gonna be showing you some products that I would normally use on my makeup routine and skincare routine, especially if I'm gonna be going out and if I know I'm running errands or if I know I'm gonna be sweating or minsan pag nag-break out ako, this is super perfect. I made sure it's super easy on the go. Plus, very important, of course, it has to be mask friendly cuz girl Masni is not our friend, okay? Hindi siya nakaka she kept. So like literally mga curls, this is gonna be the most much she kept the skincare routine and makeup routine ever sa balat ng YouTube. So make sure you keep on watching. And of course, mga curls, in case you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe down below. Hit that bell notification icon so you're always notified. And lastly, mga curls, I'll be leaving all my social media links over here. So without further ado, mga curls, let's get Alright, Mom Curls, so I'm gonna be showing you a skincare routine that's super perfect for acne prone skin, especially if you're gonna be wearing makeup and at the same time you wanna treat your skin. Because I personally I'm very oily skin and I'm very acne prone skin. It just so happens that medyo maalaga also skin ko, but I'm gonna be showing you a way on how you can take care of your skin and avoid acne and also help prevent acne and also treat acne at the same time. Just in case if you have a lot of pimples or acne, you can treat them at the same time or if you just so happen to not have it, you can prevent it naman with this method. Alright, Mako, so number one tip that I can share when it comes to the best routine for acne prone skin if you're gonna be doing your makeup or just a routine in general. If you have bangs, make sure you clip them sometimes because sometimes the number one cause of pimples on the forehead is bangs. I have a fringe over here. I always clip it. Sometimes when I'm in the house, I always clip it. Because sometimes I get breakouts on my forehead because number one, it's either stress or puyat. Because sometimes your acne or pimples can tell you that you have a problem when it comes to your body. Like parang when you have pimples around your mouth, typically your diet or sometimes hormones. So forehead, I know when it comes to the forehead, that's usually because of stress and puyat. So sometimes I get pimples on my forehead and as of now, I don't know if you can see it right now, I still I have these tiny bumps. One of the perfect products I can use for that is this Causer X Blemish Spot Clearing Serum. And also mga curls, what I really like about this serum, it's super lightweight, it has Centelia Asiatica, good for oily skin, and super light nya. Like as you can see, it's not slimy. It's literally, you're like putting water, it's super lightweight, it's good for calming the skin. Ako for the most part, most of my blemishes is on my forehead. and even the ingredients neto super ganda. They even put the ingredients right in front here. You have propolis extract. Propolis extract is also actually good for brightening the skin. So at the same time, you're brightening your skin and you're treating oily skin. So it's really nice. Plus you have niacinamide, panthenol. It even has centelia asiatica. Even you can see the consistency of the serum. Hindi siya malapot. That's what I like about the serum. Hindi siya malapot, especially if you're gonna be going out or if you're gonna be doing your makeup. Super ganda neto on the skin. So I'm just gonna be applying that on my skin, especially on my forehead because my forehead is where I normally get blemishes for the most part. Right now, I have tiny bumps because we just came from a trip and I'm kind of stressed out my skin. Ko. So, Sis needs to literally put that on her face. Like I mentioned earlier, propolis extract is good for brightening the skin. It even has niacinamide and panthenol. So, if you have dark spots as well and also dark discoloration, this can also help treat that at the same time. So, you're treating your acne, preventing acne, and if you have post-acne inflammation or post-acne scars or hyperpigmentation, this serum is a really good serum that can help with that as well. So, parang you're hitting two birds with one stone. And what I really like about the serum, it's literally super fast absorbing. As you can see, it's gone. Like, it's literally so light. Because I'm pinaka pet peeve ko when it comes to serum. I yung yung para malapot. Yung yung ganito. It's so light. And it's literally like water. If you're very oily skin and if you tend to break out with products that are very heavy on the skin that can clog the pores, expect this is not gonna clog your pores. Because this one is very lightweight. So, when it comes to serums, that like cause their X. And also, when it comes to acne prone skin. And when it comes to products that are really good for the skin barrier and also damage skin color. 
Crosshair X really gets the assignment talaga. Especially for this one, it's super lightweight. It, it can calm down the skin and it can also control your oil and also treat acne and then your dark spots. And also post acne hyperpigmentation, super ganda neto. That's why I really like this. Especially ginagamit ko to sa umaga and sometimes before my makeup if I know it's gonna be the whole day. I normally use this if I know I'm gonna be super oily so I highly recommend this. Then the next product I have here, this is super popular. This is the Crosshair X Acne Pimple Master Patch. This one has 24 patches. Alam niyo mga curls, when it comes to pimple patch, I'm not the biggest believer when it comes to pimple patches. You all know I'm opposed to that. Pero, when I tried yung Causer X Acne Pimple Master Patch, I was like, girl, why did I doubt acne pimple patches? Kasi, for the most part, so far, Causer X is one of the products na I've tried na pimple patch that actually works. Kasi yung iba na try ko, masyado manipis yung patch. Tapos parang, instead of nawawala yung blemish, parang nag-worsen pa. Like, ako lang ba? Like, comment down below. Sometimes yung mga pimple patches, it makes the pimple worse. And it just suffers the pimple, tas nagiging nana, tas nagiging kadiri. So parang, I don't usually believe in that. So this one, so Causer X, I don't know kung ano nilagay nila dito, pero totoo ang chismis, it really works. I don't have a major blemish, maybe over here, around my chin dito. There's like a little bump over here. And that's on what? And that's on puyat curl. And that's on stress. Okay. Actually, when it comes to pimples, Sometimes, it's not always hygiene, it's not always your oil. Sometimes, it's your hormones, and sometimes, it's your diet din, and sometimes, stress. Like, lately, this bitch has been stressed out, girl, like, this December. Pero, alam niyo mga girls, I just wanna also say, it's a good type of stress. Kasi, I'd rather be stressed na I'm so busy na ang dami kong kailangan gawin, rather than be stressed na wala akong ganap. Gets mo? So, parang, I'm very thankful for this kind of stress. You're blessed to be busy, you're blessed to have this type of stress. Kasi, yung iba nasa stress na wala sila mag at wala silang ganap sa life. So, I'd rather have this stress. And I'm thankful. So, I put the pimple patch here on top of my bump over here. So, I'm just gonna put that there. And, and also, mga girls, fun fact, you can put makeup on top of the pimple patch at hindi siya obvious. And one thing, mga girls, kaya inuuno ko yung pimple patch before anything else after the serum para yung serum mas mapapenetrate niya sa pimple and nasa ilalim siya ng pimple patch. So, whatever I put on top of the pimple patch, at least hindi magka-clog yung pores and penetrate pa rin niya eh. And also, what's so nice about this, it has AB F hydrocolloid dressing which extracts the impurities out of the pimple and keeps a moist environment para ma-heal yung pimple and then you're treating the pimple throughout the day and if you just happen to use this at night it'll treat your pimple throughout the night naman as well and it's not gonna come off matibay siya and also it's gonna protect the skin and or pimple or blemish when you put makeup on top so super ganda neto which mamaya I'll show you mga curls I'll be putting makeup on top of this and also mga curls very important when it comes to acne prone skin make sure your fingers and nails are clean very basic lang yan and common knowledge pero minsan nakakalimut. Minsan kasi common sense is not that common. You know what I mean? So I thought I'd just mention it. Make sure your hands and nails are clean. Alright, Malcro. So moving on to the next product. This is the Causer X Aloe Soothing Sun Cream. This has SPF 50, PA++++. This one has aloe vera extract which is good for soothing the skin. If you have acne or pimples, this is good for inflammation. Alam niyo, Malcro. I'm pretty sure I've tried this before and then hindi ko masyado na vibe siya. But I gave it a couple of tries and lately I've been enjoying this one. So, ganito siya. It's very lightweight and it doesn't leave a white cast. Ayan siya. Look. It's like that. And it smells so fresh. Ayan. Alam niyo mga curls, the reason why I put the pimple patch here before I put sunscreen is sometimes the consistency ng sunscreen can be too thick for your blemish. So, enough na yung acne patch na on top of the blemish para at least hindi siya patong na patong na maraming products. So, at least you only have the lightweight serum underneath your pimple patch. So, let me just put the sunscreen on. And also, what's so nice about this mga curls is this is super lightweight and you can use this as your daily moisturizer. Hindi siya greasy. And also mga curls, I don't know why the last time hindi ko siya nagustuhan. Pero, I'm not sure kung nasabi ko siya na hindi ko siya nagustuhan or nagustuhan ko ba. Pero, I think na-mention ko siya. Lately, I've been using this at saka I've been enjoying it na parang I gave it a second chance. Kasi nagustuhan ko tong serum na to and I was like, you know what? Let's try using Causer X products. I've been enjoying this serum. So, ito, I've been enjoying the sunscreen as well. Ayan siya. Super lightweight niya lang. It doesn't leave a white cast. On camera, it looks ashy and purple. Pero in person, wala siya. That's when you know a product has SPF because if it's under studio lights, on camera, it's reflecting the light. Kasi meron siya SPF 50 and SP NPA++ that can protect your skin from UVAs and UVBs. Especially if you have very acne prone skin and oily skin, you have to really protect your skin from the sun because of aging, sunburn, we don't want none of that. If there's also one thing I've learned before, kasi I had severe acne before, like y'all followed me my journey. There was a time na hindi ako masyado nagsa sunscreen and it just got worse. So when it comes to sunscreen, I'm super super maarte when it comes to sunscreen. I have to put sunscreen every day even 
maraming pag nasa bahay kasi sometimes, even if you're just in front of your window, there's already UVA and UVB that can damage your skin, which you don't even know. So, I mean, I'm just gonna put this on. And also, mga Chris, what I like about Cosair X products, super light niya sa skin. Like, as you can see, I already placed the serum, the pimple patch, and the sunscreen. Hindi pa siya mabigat. It feels so light and it feels so fresh and I feel clean, which is really nice. So, yun nga mga Chris, I'm gonna be showing you my skin right now. Ayan, this is the pimple patch. I already placed the serum. I put the sunscreen. Your skin is protected. You're treating your skin. Now let's put on some makeup. I have some tips for you, mga curls, when it comes to acne-prone skin and also if madali ka nagkaka-pimples. Here are some tips that you can use talaga to avoid pimples and breakouts, especially if you're acne-prone and oily skin like me and how I keep my skin pimple-free. This is what I normally do. But before that, mga curls, let me just put on some eyebrows and I'll be right back. All right, mga curls, so brows are done. So here are some tips that I can share when it comes to your skin skincare routine and your makeup routine so you can avoid breakouts. Number one, number one, this is obvious. If you're gonna be using a sponge, make sure it's clean talaga, not like this. If anything, you also have to change your, like, oh my god, Comment down below. Minsan inaamin ko. Ngayon, sinasabi ko dapat you should change your sponge. After 3 months, kailangan itapon mo na yan. Or after 4 months, itapon mo na yan. Minsan lang tumatagal siya ng mga 6 months na nakakaloka. <laughs> kailangan bumili na ng bago. Pero medyo tamad si Bak na bumili. Pero ayun. When it comes to sponges, I would recommend 3 to 4 months, get rid of it. Sometimes washing it is not enough. So it has to be brand new. At some point. So this one, obviously it's dirty. At saka mga girls, minsan sponge sponges sometimes, no matter how thoroughly you clean them, marami siyang pores eh. Minsan yung bacteria nasa pinakaloob ng sponge na hindi mo siya malalabas. So, when it comes to sponges, sometimes be careful, especially if you're very sensitive skin and acne prone skin. Kasi ayaw mo matapon yung pinaghinapan mong skincare before your makeup. Now mga girls, the question is, um, Mama Ho, what the hell am I gonna use? So, I would highly suggest when it comes to putting your makeup is use a makeup brush. So, my number one tip when you're gonna be putting makeup if you have very acne prone skin and sensitive the skin is okay gumamit ng brush sounds counterintuitive but if you think about it parang mas madaling linisan yung brush you can get to every single bristles when you wash it shampoo it soap it name it para mas madaling linisan yung brush pansin nyo compared to a sponge and you don't need to throw this out and yun nga mas madaling siyang ilinis compared to a sponge. Now, when it comes to makeup, I would suggest go and use something that can make your skin breathe because you don't want to clog your pores. So, I'm just going to be using a skin tint. Ayan siya. Onti lang. As long as you can like sheer out your blemishes. You're not trying to cover your blemishes. You're just trying to give yourself that clean look. Yun. Just put together. So, I'm just going to be using a brush and then I'm just going to buff out everything. And what's so nice about using a brush compared to a sponge if you have acne prone skin is you're not necessarily using a lot of product because if you use a sponge, sometimes it absorb lang ng sponge yung base makeup mo. So now if you're gonna be using a brush, it's not absorbing the product, it's just blending it on your skin. Now ending, you're not using a lot of product and at the same time, you're gonna avoid clogging your pores. Because if you use sponge, sometimes, depending on the foundation or skin tint, it just soaks up the base product and then you end up using a lot. And then pag gumamit ka na maraming base product, it's gonna clog your pores. So parang wala din sense yung skincare routine mo before your makeup. So as you can see, the pimple patch, medyo natatakpan siya. We can hide the pimple pimple patch. See, and it's not that heavy. And at the same time, I'm protecting my pimple or my blemish. Ayan, I'm just applying a little, little sheer layer of skin tint. And less is more, mga curls. Always practice less is more. At this point, if you have red pimples or yung mga zits, yung mga malalaking zits, let concealer do its job. I'll show you later, mga curls. As of now, I don't have that much breakouts on my skin. Just a little pimple over there. But I'll show you an example. Let's say you have a red pimple na medyo nag-raise at medyo nag inflame na. Actually, mga curls, at that point, you can put the acne pimple patch and then cover it with concealer which I'll show you mga curls. Alright, so I just sheared out the skin tint. We're good with that. Back! Alright, she is sheared out. Now I'm just gonna put concealer especially on my dark circles. Like I've said, she's stressed out. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm just putting that there and then here on my top lip, sides of my lip. And then let's say ito, this pimple patch, you have a pimple over there. 
you can put concealer so it's not obvious. And at the same time, your blemish won't have makeup kasi makapit yung acne patch ng Cosrx. Now, when it comes to concealer, I do the same thing. So when it, And then I just put a little bit on my lids. Para na cover up ko yung discoloration. Dark circles. We don't want her. Then I just take another brush that's clean and then I use that to blend the concealer. I don't use a sponge if you're wondering na parang why you're not using a sponge. Ayun nga. So the goal here is I'm just using the concealer ko ano meron dito and then I'm making the most out of it as opposed to layer and then a layer and then you end up clogging your pores hence more pimples so I'm just gonna blend this I yeah, notice I'm just using the only concealer sa mata ko. I'm just blending it out and voila and then if anything you can just use your ring finger and then blend it like so just so that your skin it will look more natural and less cakey. Alright, so I'm just gonna blend this like so. Alright, my girls, now it's time to set the face. Of course, it's powder time. I wouldn't recommend compact powders. Siguro, setting powders is enough because it's very lightweight. Plus, if you need to retouch, especially if you're very oily like me. Girl, I'm not just oily, I'm really sweaty. Mas okay if you use a setting powder because mas malalayer mo siya at malalayer pag magtatouch up ka. So, I'm just gonna apply this on the center of my face and just apply a little until mas set lang yung powder. Okay, so I'm just applying a little bit of powder on my face and on my forehead. Alright, now that she's set markers, and as you can see, this is the pimple patch. Hindi mo siya masyado napapansin, di ba? Like, you can't see it. It's here, but it's like disguise. Like, she's there, but she doesn't want to be seen. Okay, now when it comes to blush mark curls, if you're very acne prone and if you're very sensitive to skin, I wouldn't necessarily recommend cream blushes. Kasi they could clog your pores or they could be heavy for your skin. As much as it's cute, sometimes you have to make sure your makeup works with your skin type. So I would recommend you use a powder blush. So at least it's lighter and it's not heavy on the skin as opposed to a cream blush. Mas okay magamit ka na lang ng powder blush and then a cream blush because it tends to be heavy and also with the powder na nilagay mo sometimes there are some cream blushes that can make it look blotchy. Ayun, I'm just gonna apply a little bit. Alright, so blushes on, bases on, skincare is on. Now it's time for the lips. So let me just put on some lipstick and right now I'm obsessed with peachy pink lipsticks. So I'll just put this on. And I'm pretty sure we're gonna ask, Ah, Mama Ho, aren't you gonna put highlighter? Like, comment down below. Okay, bus. Sometimes I skip the highlighter if I go out because sometimes I get shiny and oily. So, you need highlighter. Ko. Then I'll just touch it up throughout the day so it's not shine free. Or I'll just use an oil blotting paper so it's not shine. But so far, this is the final look. It's super easy. This is a really good routine if you have acne prone skin or oily skin. Or if you have very bad breakouts, if you want to treat your skin while covering up your skin throughout the day. This is a really good skincare routine. So, when it comes to serum, it's this is one of my favorites. This is the Causer X Blemish Spot Clearing Serum. And also, when it comes to acne patches, I'm not the biggest believer in acne patches. But again, ito. Yung Causer X Acne Pimple Master Patch really changed my mind. I really enjoyed it. So, yun siya. You, can, you cannot even see it. Anjan siya. Pero hindi mo siya makikita. So, yun nga mga curls. It's super easy. And if you want to treat your pimples while wearing makeup, this is such a perfect routine. I'm super perfect sa inyo. And also, mga curls, if you've been a long-time follower, you've all seen my skin. How nasty and raggedy it looks like sobrang daming pimples sobrang discolored yung skin ko sobrang uneven yung skin tone ko like you've all witnessed everything and you've all tried my recommendations that you really like so this is one of my makeup routines I do pag nagbe-break out ako and especially I'm very oily this is such a good routine so ayun nga mga curls para achieve yung kashiki pan ng routine na to diba oh she's poreless she's fresh she's mashik hap achieve yung kashiki pan girl ganon and also lastly mga curls this is my skin with makeup and also the serum the sunscreen, it doesn't bunch up, it, it doesn't peel, especially the pimple patch. You can't even see it. Ayan siya. Alright, Malcro, so that concludes this video of the best skincare routine for acne prone skin and also makeup routine. What do you guys think? Like, comment down below which of the products are you most likely gonna get. And also, I forgot to mention, this is also mask friendly, especially we're wearing masks. Sometimes dito tayo nagka ka breakout sa mask ni. Almost forgot to mention that the pimple patch will definitely help sa mask ni because you're covering your pimples and at the same time, your mask is not touching the pimple itself because it's protected from the pimple patch. And thank God we're not using face shields anymore because girl, a girl is tired, okay? I am tired of wearing face shield. So yun nga mga curls, I made sure also this routine is very easy to follow. So you can also try it out yourself. And also mga curls, for this Causer X products, I purchased them on Shopee. I'll be linking it on the description box down below. And of course, mga curls, I hope you found this video interesting and helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And of course, mga curls, 
Very important is to stay machine cap. Mom, mother. How's it going? Bye, guys.